Okay, so this is my Lego Airsoft grenade, and I'll just sit this. I have a stand for my thing. I, I have a stand for my f camera that I've used that made out of Legos for it, so to hold it up, try to get you a good view of it while I'm loading it, which it takes two hands. So, these cheap Airsoft BBs that I don't want to use in my guns, I that will probably break in my gun and damage it, so I'm just going to use them in my Airsoft grenade and get rid of them since I like to use good quality in my really good guns so basically yeah people other people would agree if you if they actually play airsoft but anyways this is my grenade and it's made out of legos has a pin and a grip thing I don't really know what it's called anyways this is what you do Okay, so first blast is going to be under a container to show you the power of it, and then the next blast is just going to be a plain out explosion. And the two ways to launch it are to either load or to actually load it to where when you throw it, it hits the ground and blows up. Second way is to use the pin and just pull, push it down, and then just pull out the pin and it'll shoot up. So I'll do the first way. I'll do the pin way first, so I can actually, so I can show you guys the box explosion and then I'll do the other way next so okay hope that's a good enough angle anyways you do is put the pin in a hole in the side so I try to make this thing look the best I could with the mechanism it has because it actually has a mechanism it doesn't just come apart so yeah anyways you would push down this thing Inside, that would just shoot up the BBs, and you would put a pin in. That way it's locked down there. And then, I'm gonna... Actually, I'm gonna pull out the pin a little, so I can just pull it out for a quick blow. And, yeah. Give me a sec. Okay, that's good. And the pin kind of came apart. Sorry about that. But anyways, it's basically just an axle anyways, nothing special. But what you do is you put some BBs in there. It doesn't take much. I mean, I'm just putting in some, you know. But basically now I'll try to get into a good angle to see this. So, when I let go of the grenade, you'll hear all of the BBs hit the plastic. And a bunch of them flew everywhere. So that was the power of it. And now for the actual explosion, you'll probably get a better view of this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to load it with the camera sitting down, then I'm going to pick up the camera and then throw it. So, I'll try to load it as fast as I can. Now, it does take a little bit longer than other grenades to load, but it's definitely worth it if you, if you like explosions. Big explosions, might I add. It, oh yeah. yeah, the range of it, I have measured it to shoot up to like, um, 20 feet. So, basically all the way across my basement, which was pretty awesome. Yeah, so, I didn't expect it to shoot that far, really, but, yeah, it's pretty awesome. So, now there's a grip that basically you, I'll show you this real quick. You basically just stick it on the Legos, and then when you want to throw it, you just grab it, and it falls off, which I don't really want to do, because I have limited hands and stuff. So, yeah, that's just some extra thing, but here I'll try, let me see. Okay, it's definitely ready. So here we go. Here's the grenade, and I'll try to give you the best view. And video, I mean, BBs are everywhere. Heard them go into a sink. Everywhere. There's one over there. I'm in a enclosed space, like in my last video of my last grenade, which I told you I'd shoot of this grenade. So yeah. It's, it's, yeah, it's very powerful. There's ones everywhere. I heard some hit in the sink, which is basically way over there. And, 
yeah, so that's, it's a pretty awesome grenade, and I could potentially do a tutorial of this if enough people want it, ask for it, um, watch my videos, you know, tell other people about them if they like Legos, I mean, yeah, I have a lot of videos on our channel, so just check us out, and if you like them, then just like it, add a comment, tell me for, ask for tutorials, if I get enough views and subscribers, then I'll definitely make a tutorial for something like this, so, yep, that's pretty much it, bye.